Hi, how are you? Matt Watson here from CarWow. So I'm sitting in a Ferrari SF90 Stradale and I'm gonna have a drag race against the new Rimac Nevera. Can you believe it? Now I've come to a runway in Croatia, brought this car along, because they're making some bold claims about that car. But before I talk you through the details on that, I'm gonna tell you about this Ferrari because it's pretty impressive. So we've got a four litre twin turbo V8, it's mid-mounted, but you've also got a bunch of electric motors. Combined, you get 1,000 horsepower. That's nuts. Also, you've got electric motors on the front axle, so you've got four wheel drive. It's gonna be quick, this car. I know it is. Is it gonna be quicker than that Rimac? We're gonna find out. Another thing you need to know about this car is that it weighs in at just under 1,800 kilos. Price-wise, 376,000 pounds. Anyway, let's find out about that Rimac from the guy who built it. It's Matty Rimac from Rimac. Hey, Matty, how are you? Good, Matt, how are you? Yeah, I'm good. So, I've heard that you're claiming that that car you're sat in, your new, Nevera. is the quickest accelerating production car in the world. Is that right? Well, Matt, I'm not claiming anything. Let's see. Before we race, though, I'd like to know the stats on your car. You should know them, right? Yeah, I know one or two. So 1,900 horsepower, four electric motors, 120 kilowatt hour battery pack, 2,360 newton meters of torque, and uh, lots of uh, power on the wheels. Yeah, I think you've said that before. That's like the quickest run out of stats that I've ever heard anyone give. Anyway, what we're gonna do is just quickly put up a little slate now so you can have a look at the stats side by side for these cars. So pause the video now. There you go. Let's get on with the race. Now, before we do, please make sure you subscribe to this channel, hit the bell icon to turn your notifications on. That way you won't miss a single upload. Also, why don't you follow me on Instagram, Matt Watson Cars. Anyway, let's do this because it's going to be nuts. I know this car's going to be quick, but how quick is that Rimac going to be? Buying a new car? Then head to CarWow and my team will help you find your next car at a fair price. CarWow your one-stop car buying comparison site. Now, before we get on with the drag race, we've got to do the customary car wow sound check. So I'm going to rev up this Ferrari. Let's have some twin turbo V8 noise. Oh, that revs so smoothly. Look at that. Uh, Matty, uh, can you rev up your car? I could burn front or rear tires independently or all four of them if you like but maybe not now after the drag races maybe so let's cut to some sounds that that car might make anyway that's enough of that let's race right before we go i just want to ask one question like with this ferrari i've got to put it into launch and i've got like about five seconds to then engage the launch control action with the right foot planted and the revs building if i don't time it right I could fluff the start. Have you got some kind of weird procedure that you need to go through in that Rimac? Just hold the brake, uh, throttle as long as you wish, release the brake, that's it, off you go. Okay, so you got the easy job, I've got the hard job. D doesn't matter, doesn't matter. Right, so I'm ready. I mean, I didn't get a great launch. Uh, so, Matty, my launch wasn't great, and then um, I started to go backwards. We can do it again if you like. I definitely want to go again, because I think I might be able to do a bit better. Okay, I want to see you do better. Are you taking the piss out of my Midlands accent? You can do the same with me with my Croatian accent. I can't do a Croatian accent, <laughs> maybe I'll learn one. Oh, I wasn't really with it on the launch. I was noticed his hands going up and then I had to do the launch procedure. I did it in time, but I'm going to be focused this time. Focus, focus, focus. Three, two, one. Smash them off the line. That's a better start. What? What again? So much fun getting so badly beaten. <laughs> Whoa, I had a good launch there. It was pretty blumming good. I still think I beat you off the line. Should we just talk about reaction times rather than the overall result? So did you like the way I beat you off the line? You spanked me. Bravo. <laughs> okay, mate, come just one more. 
more go. Come on. I think I might be able to do a bit better. Absolutely, let's do it. He doesn't seem to care. I reckon if I'm going to stand any chance, I need to cheat really badly. Three, two, one. Yeah, got him. And it's a good launch. Come on. No, no. What the actual fuck? Right, I'm bored of this. I want to switch cars. Can I drive your car? Matt, I'm bored of winning as well. Please take the car. Yes, I'm going to drive it. I want to drive it. I want to see what happens. I want to see what it feels like. I've now jumped into the Rimac Nevera. <laughs> so, Matty isn't driving the Ferrari. It's political reasons because he does work for lots of different manufacturers. So instead, I've got him to start the race. So this is fun. Let's see what happens. I want to feel this. I can't wait to just see what the acceleration is like. And it's much easier to launch than the Ferrari. Apparently I can have it in any mode. And as long as I put my left foot on the brake for the throttle, it'll know I want to launch. And it's just, yeah, simple. So let's see if I can do a good job. Three. Now I'm ready to launch. Two. Smashed him. I imagine that's what it feels like to be shot out the barrel of a gun. It's just insane. There was a Ferrari in that race. It got beaten quite badly. So how is it? You know, your car's really slow. It, yeah. only, it just did you the- You fell asleep. Yeah, it, it only did the quarter mile in 8.6. Oh. It's a bit Really, you measured 8.6? There you have a world record for a production car. Congratulations, Matt. Oh. We'll have a beer tonight. I just broke a world record. <laughs> actually, you did. Uh, actually, I didn't. The car did. <laughs> <laughs> really? 8.6? 8.6? Wow. We thought we will achieve that on a prepped surface. We achieved like 8.7 so far. So with you now, you, you actually got the best time so far. Oh, that's <laughs> wicked. So then what exactly happened? Well, the Rimac did the standing quarter mile in 8.62 seconds, which, as Matty said, is a world record for a road car, albeit an unofficial world record. The Ferrari, meanwhile, took 10 seconds to do the selling quarter mile. However, the best time I had at the Ferrari was in the second race, where it did a 9.6 second quarter mile, which is still very impressive. Now we're going to a rolling race from 50 kilometers an hour. We've got the cars in the sport settings. Ferrari's in manual mode. He'll be in second gear. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. That's even madder than the launch. I let him go a bit just because I could, but that is just crazy. Here he is now, here he is. No, you don't. <laughs> oh, you could be a real nightmare with this car. Gordon, what happened to you, mate? I'll actually let you go a little bit ahead of me just on purpose. Did you like fluff a gear change or something? No, really, no, no slips, everything full attack, qualifying mode. Nothing else happened than lack of power. Uh, what, like a thousand horsepower is not enough. <laughs> it's, well, it's not today, is it? Let's be honest. Okay, so Gordon, when you want to, you can accelerate. Go accelerate as hard as you can towards the tent. Whenever you're ready, just go accelerate. Watch this. I mean, this is just what it's about. It's, it's irrelevant. It's irrelevant. That was crazy right there. Yeah, you lost again, Gordon. Gordon. What are, you, what are you doing? You're playing here with me, I think. <laughs> yeah, it's so much fun as well. <laughs> Sorry. You did a good job. Thank you for coming. Now we're going to have a brake test from 120 kilometers an hour. When we reach the cones, full emergency stop. See which car stops in the shortest distance. Here we go, we're up to speed now. So here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. <laughs> what? Really? I'm, I'm going to have to get out because I'm not sure about this. It's so close. I think I might have a longer bonnet than you, so I might have just lost, but it's close. Oh, yeah. Look at them doors. These doors are nice. Okay. 
Right, this is serious. No way, look, seriously, look at this. This is just the saddest walk I've ever done in my life. But it's a walk to victory. I lost again. You lost. <laughs> yes. I can't believe that. I can't believe that. Well. Yeah, I do like those doors. Well, there we go. Uh, surprised. I thought my bonnet was longer than his. Turns out it's not. I did beat him. Wow, this thing, insane. Utterly insane. Now, if you want to check out <laughs> a Rimacon car, wow, you can't, sorry. You can't. But if you want to check out some other cars, in fact, an electric car that's really quick, you'll really enjoy it. It is good fun. I'll put a link to it there. Click on the pop-up button. You can check that out if you want to. And as ever, please, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you subscribe to this channel and hit the bell icon to turn your notifications on. That way you won't miss a single upload. Wow. If you'd like to find out more about the Rimac Nevera, click on that video window there because I've done an exclusive walk around of the car with its creator, Matte Rimac, for my own personal channel, Matt Watson Car. So go check that out. Actually, in that video, Matte gives me a very strange gift. You have to find out what it is. It is bizarre. Just click on the window there. Now, if you click there, you can check out the car where I drag race leaderboard to see just how well the Rimac did compared to all the other cars we drag raced. And as ever, if you enjoyed the video, please give it a like and make sure you subscribe to this channel. I'll see you next time.